Uh, that's what we called it, a thrashing ring. And uh, there was uh, 11 of us in our ring. We was the South, South Hammond group, and there was one on the North Hammond group. And uh, I am still acting president of the Orange Hammond Avenue thrashing ring. <laughs> I have one member left alive. <laughs> <laughs> no, Neil Neil Fike is still alive. He's he's in Friendship Village now, but uh, we had a, a shed up at a uh, mile north of us, just north of Hollis's there, that uh, we kept both the thrash machines and and the silage cutter and, and binder in in that shed, and uh, we. Uh, would get together and and we usually helped each other cut and shock. Usually one or two neighbors would uh, get together and do it, and then we'd th thrash and, and uh, usually start at one end and keep going up the line till we got done. And the uh, manager of the thrashing crew would keep a time schedule on everybody because no, nobody had the same same amount of oats or same amount of acres and and so when the machine started why well, he kept a sheet of everybody how many laborers he had and uh, whether they had a bundle wagon whether they shoveled grain or whether they pitched in the field uh, each guy had a different separate wage and the value placed on the wagons that he provided, and uh, it was quite a bookkeeping feature. And then when we get done, why well, we'd always have a big picnic, and and everybody to settle up if you owed uh, somebody, if you had uh, sixty or eighty acres of oats, and somebody only had twenty, and uh, the machine everything went good, why uh, the guy with twenty gets some money. But uh, it was it was real interesting, and it was a, a kind of a dirty job. But uh, we always ate real good. The meals were excellent. The ladies would get together and help and try to outdo the, what the neighbors had. You get home at night. What did you have for dinner? And <laughs> well, maybe we can have something a little better than that, more pies or something. But. Uh, the food was excellent, and we had a good time. Most most of the workers were real good, and it was always a challenge to see who could get be the first one off at night, so he'd get home quicker to do the other chores. And, uh, you you can you can uh, if you tried hard, you could make fun of anything, and uh, we had a good good bunch. <laughs>